So my, in my last video we talked a lot about the snowplow and as I promised we're gonna go a step further today. We are still using the snowplow as you see but we need to gain more speed. Because what I'm gonna do now as you see I'm gaining more speed and I'm turning my snowplow into magic. Let's do it again. Snow blow, snow blow. Magic. Okay, this method of breaking, entering the magic, it's not a must. Not everybody, I mean, most of the people don't use it as a method to enter the magic. But it's good to know. And in my experience in the past few years, some of my students so what's important is really to be in the inside edges you need carefully to choose which leg is going to be in front the leg which is going to be in front the more you apply the edge the less chances you're going to have a high side you're going to fall because this leg is really um, enter the slide and needs to slide. So the more edge you apply, the more chances and the more and, and more easily it's gonna it's gonna slide and not continue to skate. What's important is to try as less as you can to move with your hips and shoulders. You try to look you look forward and you try to really not participate with your shoulders and hips. Okay? And what's important is, is the last, the last leg, the, the leg that's behind me, as I'm doing now, the T is exactly what it's going to do when I turn. You need to, you need to apply pressure on it. You need to move it um, through your body because it's going to be in the back. If you don't do nothing, you're going to fall and you're not going to succeed in magic. Okay, so again, let's do it again so you can see. I'm doing snow blow. Okay, I'm gonna enter with my right leg in front, so I'm keeping it low, nice edge, and I'm turning. You see, I'm turning as less as I can with my hips and shoulders and look forward. Okay, so this is the magic from a snow blow. It's good to know you don't have to, but it's a good practice and. Uh, it's a good method if you if you are stopping in snowplow and you can't anymore, your hips are dead, your muscles are dead, it's painful and you want to stop and it's not stopping anymore. So, so what you're doing is you're turning your snowplow to the side and it becomes a magic.